Well, welcome to the wonderful Dallas-Fort Worth Metroplex where it's supposed to be 112 degrees today. So what do you do as a music photographer when it's 112 degrees? There's a lot to do. So I'm going to take you through some of the preparation we're going to do today and I'll see you in a minute. Okay, so I lied. It's 107, but it's on its way to 109. Like I said earlier, it's only 107 degrees. Um, on its way to somewhere near 112 is what, well, that's at least what my Alexa device told me this morning. So I got to, I don't believe Alexa, but I got to believe Alexa this time. So what do you do in, um, when uh, it's this, excessively hot and uh, you shoot mostly outdoors and right now at this time of day there isn't anything going on uh, indoors so uh, what do you do? Well I started to make a video a little bit earlier but uh, changed my mind on what I had. Anyway if you're looking for something to do as a music photographer and it's 112 degrees out right now it's uh, 840 and it's 105 degrees here in Dallas nobody's gonna go outside in this weather it's crazy the air is bad uh, there's several things you can do one you can take all your gear get it all organized see if you're missing anything clean all your memory cards charge your batteries if you need anything you can order your stuff hopefully you'll get it before your next uh, your next shoot another thing you can do I would suggest looking at my social media and uh, getting it all in order, cleaning it up. Look at my um, look at my Instagram, look at uh, my uh, Facebook, uh, YouTube, that kind of thing. Put it all back in order. See if it uh, you can do any work on it. Check your email. See if you've got any messages, things like that that you need to answer, take care of. And another thing you can do that's really pretty good is take and um, look at what's coming into your area in your area soon uh, right now I'm looking about a month out and the Louisville Western Days is coming up on the 29th and 30th uh, a friend of mine's got an, uh, a band he's playing with that's going to end up on the, like the 14th in in, uh, in the colony so that's of interest and uh, check to see if there's anything that you might have of interest that you can follow up on and, and uh, get access to. Um, don't let this time go to waste. I know like in Minnesota when it's the middle of December through February and there's three foot of snow on the ground, you're not wanting to go out and go to a festival in three foot of snow. I, I, I heard people in Colorado do. Oh, okay. But um, use this time that you have available to you to be productive and uh, see if you can get uh, yourself a little better organized. Thank you for watching this video. If you find anything useful, uh, please ring the bell. Keep notified. Go ahead and uh, subscribe. We'd like to have, have everybody subscribe. If you've got any questions, comments, concerns, confusions, anything like that, um, please, by all means, answer in the, uh, put them in the comments. We'll answer you as soon as we can, as best we can. Uh, if we miss anything, send it again. Please visit uh, our web, my website at www.robertcmaxfield.com and uh, see my Instagram at uh, Robert C. Maxfield and uh, check those things out and we'll see you soon. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.